Babe, why'd you put a finger down? You don't like men. <laughs> True. Babe, baby? Put a finger down if your boyfriend just got eliminated from the game. That seems a little specific. Put a finger down if you're wearing a black shirt with gold hoop earrings and a necklace with a gem in the middle. Okay, what the flip? Psst, Timmy. Timmy. Ouch. I think the game is trying to eliminate me. Why? Because they're only saying things that are specific to me. Put a finger down if you're looking at Timmy right now and just spoke to him over three seconds ago. See? A lot of people look at me and speak to me, so... Look, and now I don't have a hand. Put a finger down if you're wearing pink lipstick. That's it. Brianna, what are you doing? I don't have to put a finger down. What they're saying isn't true. Put a finger down if you have two eyebrows. I need to shave my eyebrows. All right, 10 tasks, then I meet my soulmate. Easy. You're not getting easy. I'm gonna need you to put a dollar in this bed right now. What? No. Don't make me use this. Is that your phone? No, it's poisonous. Put it in the bed. Okay, geez. Okay, class, is everyone ready for the test? No, I'm not. And why not? Because it's stupid and I didn't want to study for it. You don't think my tests are worth studying for? No, I don't think they are, and you're a bad teacher. Well, that's just fine because you won't have to write the test. Go to detention. What happened in there? I can't believe you missed the test. My soulmate better be worth this. Worth what? We can't be friends anymore. I'm sorry. Oh, please don't make me choose. Choose. Hey, sorry I'm late. Why hasn't class started yet? The teacher is on some kind of super serious phone call. Thanks for letting me know. I'll make sure everyone's safe. Goodbye. Class, there has been multiple zombie sightings. No one is going home tonight. That's impossible. What? No way. I want to go home. Don't you dare come here. How can you read at a time like this? I'm just trying to clear my head, that's all. The zombies are approaching the building. Stay calm, everyone. How can I be calm at a time like this? Just stay away from us. Oh, no. The zombies. They're coming in the building. Get me out of here. What are we going to do? Why do you have so many crushes all of a sudden? I do? Really? How many? 200. 200? Nice. How was that nice? Says the guy with over four million simps. How did you do it? I, uh, I started TikTok. Let me see. No, no, don't. Seriously? You're posting thirst traps? 2,000 crushes, really? I have 2,000 crushes already? I can't believe I ever even liked you. How can you even be upset? You have way more crushes than I do. Yeah, but I didn't purposely get people to crush on me just to spite you. Look, I'm sorry. I was just jealous, and I thought if I had lots of crushes too, we could be equal. Save it, all right? I'm leaving. Have fun with your simps. Yeah, and you have fun with yours. The date was amazing. OMG, I saw you on TikTok. You're so cute. <laughs> Did you just bark at me? She's a psycho. Are you serious? How do you have four million crushes? Hey, do you have a pencil I can borrow? Uh, sure. Here. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Why are you mad? I thought we talked about this already. Sorry, I guess I just wanted you all to myself. Such a beautiful day out today. Isn't it? Hey, cutie, are you by chance single? No, he's not actually. He has a girlfriend, and it's me. Oh, really? Yes! Stop acting like this. You're acting crazy. I can't do this anymore. Seriously? Sending me more money at a time like this? <laughs> hey, come with me. No, I don't know you. I'm your soulmate. What? So you're my soulmate? Yeah. What are you, a part of some sort of sketchy little mafia? I'm a scam artist. Huh. Even better. They took you, knowing it would leave me there. I sent you the money because I thought it would be safe. I was wrong. We have to leave immediately. Can you help me out with these first? Look, I'm tired of running. Where are we even going? It's the police. Run. Did we lose them? I think so. Listen, 
I have one more scam I need to do, then we're out of here. You and me can move away and live on a private island together. No. But I'm your soulmate. You're a crook. I'm not just going to get up and leave my friends and family to go off and run away with you. Leave me alone. Wait. Guys, my soulmate just sent me a million dollars. Seriously, no fair. Mine sent me nothing. He must be rich. What do you think he does? He probably works for the Mafia. Whoa. Scary. Why do you guys always have to think the worst? He's probably just a successful business owner. My soulmate just sent me another million. Wow, how do you plan on spending the money? I don't know. It just... It all seems a little suspicious to me. I feel like something's not right. Here are your drinks, ladies. Thank you. You're rich now, right? You pay for the drinks. Whatever. Ma'am, I'm gonna need you to come with me. Why? What's wrong, officer? All that money you've been given is stolen money. I'm gonna need you to come down to the station. What? No! I'm innocent, I swear! Esme, I think I found my soulmate. <laughs> That's great. Why are you upset? Because he's an entitled TikTok influencer. Come on, give him a chance. Ask him out on a date. You might change your mind. I need to know if he's truly my soulmate. Hey. Hey, nerd. So, I think you might be my soulmate. Let me explain. My soulmate has over 2 million people crushing on them, and you have over 2 million followers on TikTok. So I just need to go on a date with you to test if this theory is true. So you like me? No, I never said that. I said that you might be my soulmate. Makes sense. My soulmate has zero crushes. Then it must not be me, because I would have way more than that. I don't think so. Do you want to go on a date or not? Sure. I'll pick you up at 11. Alright. Sounds good. See you then. It's time for the big reveal. What did I get? You got gold. Gold? <gasps> I knew it. I was born for fame. Okay, show me yours. What did I get? <gasps> you got gold too. Oh my god, we are so lucky. Girl, did you hear they're looking for a girl with a pink mark? They say she's the long lost princess. What? <laughs> no way. The prince was also given a pink mark. There's only two people within the whole kingdom with a pink mark. You know, gold never really suit me, but marrying a prince sure will. Hello, sir. I'm here to see the prince. Nobody sees the prince. Yeah, okay. Oh, uh, ma'am, I'm so sorry. Please come with me right away. <laughs> of course. And I won't feel left at all. And you can't feel left in small. Honey, I love you. That's all she wrote. Oh, oh, feel the eye. You've been on my mind, girl, like a drug. Oh, oh, feel the eye. Heaven help a fool falls in love. Oh, oh, feel the eye. You've been on my mind, girl, since the flood. Oh, oh, feel the eye. I can't wear these anymore. You have to smile, or I'm going to put the clothing pins back on, okay? Okay. Honey, you know I'm doing this because I love you, right? If you get caught not smiling, you'll be executed. Yeah. Me sissy walking. Ah! You made me fall. Oh, sorry, sissy. <laughs> I think I broke my leg. S sissy, <laughs> you're not smiling. We have a code red. Hurry. Smile. You look so beautiful when you smile, babe. Well, that's good, because that's all we're allowed to do, so... My mother was just executed. Baby, you're not smiling. Smile. I can't believe she's gone. Baby, they're watching. Hurry up, smile. <coughs> Baby, smile. We've got a code red. If you're happy and you know it, push someone down the stairs. Hello, Brianna. Principal Stevens, you can go down the stairs first. How kind of you. Principal Stevens? Principal Stevens? I think I killed him. If you're happy and you know it, say hooray. Hooray! Are you okay? You look worried. My boyfriend is not going to be happy with me. I killed his dad. Principal Stevens? How could you? You killed my dad? Babe, wait. Please just listen to me. I didn't have a choice. I got happy and you know it to push someone down the stairs. I didn't know he died. 
Why would you choose my dad? If you're happy and you know it, break up with your boyfriend. Babe, we have to break up. You just got a happy and you know it, didn't you? That's funny. I just got one to kill you. I only have one heart left. I can't get heartbroken again. I know what to do. Whoa, Brianna looks hot. Hey, girl, come sit with us. Yesterday, when you said I couldn't sit with you guys, you made me lose a heart. I can't trust you guys won't break my heart again. You never even deserved it in the first place. Babe, you look so good today. I'm not your babe. Yesterday, you didn't want to be with me because I had pimples. You made me lose a heart. I only have one left because of you. I can't trust you won't break my heart again. I'm sorry. Class, we have a new student today. Everyone meet John. You can sit wherever you like, John. Hey, can I sit here? Sure, do whatever you want. Lucky me. I get to sit next to the prettiest girl in the class. Look, I'm not interested. I can't risk getting involved with another person again. Hey, wait, why did you say you can't risk getting involved with another person? I only have one heart left. If I get heartbroken again, I'll die. I only have one heart left, too. How about we take the risk together? <laughs> Mommy, I have hearts all over my face. Oh, you got your hearts, but you only have three. Those hearts represent the amount of times you're allowed to be heartbroken. Every time someone breaks your heart, you lose one of your hearts. So what happens if I have no hearts left? You die. <gasps> hey, besties. <clears throat> Pizza face. <laughs> Jake, stop it. You can't sit with us. Everyone's looking at you because of all your pimples on your face. It's embarrassing. It's just a little breakout. I've been really stressed recently. You can't sit with us. Is my acne really that bad? A heart's missing. That means they broke my heart. Hey, babe. Bro, what's all over your face? Yeah, babe, what happened? It's just pimples. It will go away. <laughs> That's your girl, bro? She's not my girl. I'm not. I only have one heart left. I can't get heartbroken again. I know what to do. Best friend, Sophie, she has laughing disease. We have to get rid of her. <laughs> You're laughing. No, no, I'm fine, I'm fine. Please, please, I don't have it. I don't have the laughing disease. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'm laughing. Goodbye, world. <laughs> <laughs> Brianna, stop. Stop laughing if you want to live. Stop what? Were you laughing? No, no. I was just practicing in case I did catch the laughing disease. The laughing disease is incurable. If you catch it, you're doomed. Now get to class. <laughs> stop. Stop laughing. I knew it. I knew you had the laughing disease. Say bye-bye, Brianna. No, no, I'm not infected. I'm telling you. Good morning, Dad. I'm off to school now. Ha, 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 ha. Dad? Ha, 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 How's my best friend today? My dad has a laughing disease. That means both my parents are gone. I can't go home tonight. Do you think I can stay at your place? I have to go. Where are you going? Your dad has the laughing disease. You could have caught it. I can't risk it. Stay away. Class, does anyone know the answer to? ha, ha, ha. Everyone out! Students, stay out here. I'll take care of Miss Applewood. That was so scary. Are you doing okay, Bree? I thought you didn't want me near you, in case I'm contagious. I know what I said. I was just worried. <laughs> Babe, is everything okay? Jake, it, it's my best friend, Sophie. She has the laughing disease. We have to get rid of her. <laughs> You're laughing. No, no, I'm fine, I'm fine. Go team! I knew you would win, Jake. Of course I won. You were cheering me on. Look, it's Porky the Pig. Get it? Because you're fat? <laughs> My name's not Porky, it's Cynthia. Porky, I can smell your Big Mac scented sweat from over here. Stinky, funky, like, ew! Why are you so mean? <laughs> Why am I so chubby? How did I gain so much weight in a day? Oh no, did you make someone insecure? You were born with a curse. If you make someone insecure, you'll get their insecurity. So you're saying I'm stuck like this? I'm ready for cheer! Brianna, you really let yourself go. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'll lose weight in no time. Well, until you do, you can't cheer with us. Are you serious right now? <laughs> I'd like to audition for the cheer squad. Porky, you're skinny? I told you, my name's Cynthia. Wait, Cynthia, I should apologize. Yes, finish the slice of pizza before the timer runs out. I finished my slice already. You got this, Bree. Last bite. 
Brianna, hurry, swallow, the timer's almost out. Safe. Brianna, you did it. Thanks for encouraging me there, Jake. I was almost ready to give up. Do this. Kiss someone. I guess we should kiss? I mean, I guess we have to. Well, that wasn't so bad. Do this. Grab a water bottle. Do that. Drink from the water bottle. Right, I'm so thirsty. Jake, no, she didn't say do this. She said do that. Goodbye, Brie. I love you. Do this. Kill someone. Do this. Don't kill anyone. The rules never said we couldn't play. Bye, Brie. I'm heading home now. See you tomorrow. Bye, babe. <laughs> Bye. I haven't received a kiss mark yet. Brianna, did you see that? We just had our first kiss. Wow, that is so great. I gotta go. Good morning, Steph. You haven't received a lip mark yet. I guess Jason's not your soulmate? Even if Jason's not my soulmate, I'm still going to be with him. Maybe I just haven't received my lip mark yet. Maybe. Uh-oh, you received another lip mark. Looks like your soulmate kissed another girl. She's yeah, dead. I guess he has. Jason, may I kiss you? What? No, why? Because I think you might be my soulmate. When you kiss Steph, I received a lip mark right after. Okay, just don't tell Stephanie. What are you doing? <gasps> that must be my soulmate. Did you send your address to Mr. James? You made a big mistake. Your address is permanently on Mr. James' face. He will have to wear a mask from now on. I'm really sorry. I wasn't thinking. I just really wanted to meet my soulmate. If you try and contact him again, you'll pay. Yes, sir. Brianna, you got another mark on your face from your soulmate. Oh, it's Hard Eyes. Did you meet him? No, some big scary guy came to my house saying, If you try to contact Mr. James, you'll pay. The Mr. James? Who? No one's ever seen Mr. James before, but allegedly he's the son of one of the most dangerous mafia bosses in the world. Brianna, look at your face. He must need help. What should I do? Nothing. It's dangerous. Come with me. I'm going to choose the hate apple. I need to know who my hate is. That way, I can find the baby. I can breathe. Hits the tripod. <laughs> no thanks. I don't need anyone. No thanks. I don't need any help. Go find someone else. <laughs> love apple or hate apple? Mom, what is this? You must choose between your love apple and your hate apple. The love apple tells you who loves you, and the hate apple will tell you who hates you. I'm choosing the hate apple. I need to know who my haters are. Here's your test back. You failed. An F again? I definitely deserved an A this time. You don't like me. No wonder you keep failing me. You're failing me on purpose. No, I'm failing you because you give the wrong answers. Babe, there you are. I missed you so much. I haven't seen you all day. <laughs> yeah, I miss you too. You hate me? We've been dating for over a year and you hate me? It's just you're a little clingy and your face kind of looks like my ex who cheated on me. Well, we're over. I'm not going to be with someone who hates me. We've got a loser on the loose. I don't get it. Why do you hate me so much? Ew, why did I just feel a kiss on my cheek? I feel something on my cheek. What? Honey, that means your soulmate must have had his first kiss. Every time your soulmate kisses someone new, you will receive a lip mark on your face. You know no fair. Why is my soulmate kissing other girls? You You're so lucky. Your soulmate's only kissed one girl. Mine's kissed so many. Maybe he's kissing those girls looking for you. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter. You're the one he's going to be with. You're right. I think Jason and I are going to have our first kiss today. I'll finally know if he's really my soulmate. She's Bye, Bree. I'm heading home now. See you tomorrow. Bye, babe. <laughs> Bye. I haven't received a kiss mark yet. Brianna, did you see that? We had our first kiss. Wow, that is so great. Brianna, what's your first choice for a name? Anita Dump. Then you should probably go use the bathroom. No, that's the first choice I have for a name. I'm obviously not going to choose that one. I already chose my name. It was my first option. Really? What'd you choose? Joe King. 
You're joking. No, I'm not joking. I'm serious. That's the name I chose. Jenny Talia. Aw, oh, that name sounds so pretty. I'm gonna choose it. No, come here. I'll tell you what it sounds like. I am not choosing that name. Yuri Nading? I'm obviously not going to choose that one. Wait, you only get a certain amount of passes. If you don't choose in time, you'll be nameless. So you think I should choose urinating? It's better than being nameless. Well, you're joking. I'm not joking around, Brianna. Choose carefully. Here, happy birthday, Brianna. Thank you. Are you okay? I'm feeling so weak. Oh no, honey, come with me now. Here, put this charger in your charging port right there. I've been secretly charging you every day, but it's time that you know. You're not like the other kids. If you don't charge yourself and your battery's gone, you'll die. You must keep this a secret, because if the other kids find out, they'll treat you differently, okay? Okay. I'm all charged and ready for the day. Welcome to gym class. Today we're going to be running 100 laps. Oh no. I'm gonna lose all my battery. Your what? Nothing. Keep running! I... I can't. I'll be back, coach. I need more charge. What the... Ooh, mommy's makeup. No! You can't ever put anything on your face. Anything that touches your face becomes permanent. Now that blush will be on you forever. What? Mom really wasn't lying. It's never gonna come off. Hey, Brianna, you got some lipstick on your cheek. Here, use one of my makeup wipes. No, it won't come off. Anything that touches my face is permanent. What? <laughs> Brianna, you're so funny. Want to come over to my slumber party tonight? Sure, I'd love to. What should we do now? How about a pillow fight? Ah! <laughs> Good night, everyone. I'm so tired. I'm going to bed. Night. Sleep tight. <laughs> Good morning, guys. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Here, you need to look at yourself. You look so silly. Do you know what you guys just did? And what, and what, and what, and what, and what? Freeze. Oh, oh, leg cramp, leg cramp. <laughs> no, Kevin, baby, I'm coming to save you. Unfreeze. Oh, no, Brianna, were you playing three cents? Because of you, Brittany and Kevin are dead. She killed Brittany and Kevin? She's sick. No, no, it's not like that, I promise. Hey, leave her alone. Brianna, come with me. Hey, thanks for getting me out of there. I really appreciate it. It was nothing. Do you remember Timmy? Timmy? Freeze. Wait, am I supposed to freeze now? Yeah, I do remember him. He died playing freeze dance back when I was six. He was my brother. It's time that I finally avenge his death. I challenge you to a game of freeze dance. Are you serious? Why am I the one always getting calls? Brianna, you need to answer it. No, this isn't fair. Hurry. Answer now or die. Your word? Anti-disestablishmentarianism. Anti... Anti-dis-dis-disestablishment. Dis, Pass on your word. Give me a minute. Brianna, hurry, pass the word on to me. I can't. It's too hard. Teacher? Teacher, I have to pass a word on to you. Anti-disestablishmentarianism. Easy word. You know I'm an English teacher, right? Jake, come here. Anti-disestablishment. <laughs> I'm getting a call. Who's there? Who are you? Show yourself. Mother's here. You really thought I'd let you stop playing Mother May I that easy? What? In order to stop playing Mother May I, you must defeat me. Mother, please don't do this. I don't want to go up against you. I love you. You? You do? Yes. Has anyone ever told you that before? No, they did not. I thought all my children were just ungrateful. Mother May I give you a hug? You may. Congratulations, you are now mother. What? Who is this? I thought I just killed mother. <laughs> there are multiple mothers. Mother!
May I drink water? Mother, may I go home? Mother, may I use the bathroom? Mother! Brianna, you got a mark! I did? That means I must have passed my soulmate! That means someone in this hallway is your soulmate. Introduce yourself to as many people as you can. Good idea. Hey, you have a mark on your face. Hi, my name is Brianna. Nice to meet you. I'm Johnny. It's not you. Excuse me, excuse me. Hi, my name is Brianna. Nice to meet you. I'm Eugene. <laughs> Thank goodness it's not him. I'm glad that you're not my soulmate. I'm way out of your league anyways. <laughs> what? Brianna, how'd it go finding your soulmate today? Not good. I couldn't find him. Someone in the school is my soulmate. I just need to figure out who. Guess you'll have to try again tomorrow. Yeah. Hey, watch where you're going. Dory. I hit my nose. <gasps> Brianna, you got a number. You only get three guesses and three hints. After that, you're out. Is it a number from 1 to 10? It is. Is it 3? What's the number? You can't ask what the number is. Is it a number below 5? Yes. 2? Safe. Oh no, Bestie, there's a number on your head. Is the number higher or lower than 10? Higher. 11? Come on, think! Is it an odd or even number? Even number. Um, 19? 19's an odd number. That's it, I'm just gonna guess. 12. Brianna, you got a number! Oh, shit! Good morning, Mom. I spy with my little eye my mom. Here, take your vision blocking glasses. I spy with my little eye these vision blocking glasses. Wear them as much as you can so you don't have to say I spy all the time. I barely take mine off. I spy with my little eye the ground. I spy with my little eye the bush. I spy with my little eye the bus. Class, can anyone tell me why the earth is flat? My eyes are so itchy. My glasses, where'd they go? Timmy, say I spy. I spy with... I spy with my little eye a beautiful girl named Brianna. Chad, is that you? Of course it's me. Take off your glasses so I can see your beautiful eyes. I... I don't know. It's not really safe. Come on, Brianna. I just want to see your eyes. You know you can trust me. Okay. Give me those. I just got a lyric! Answer carefully, because every time you get it correct, you get money, and the finalists will win millions. The boys blank blank, the boys blank blank. You're so much better than my girlfriend. Derek, you're cheating on me? Uh, no. The boy's a liar! The boy's a liar! I am your mother, blank 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 blank. Hello? You forgot to turn off the stove. The whole kitchen's on fire. Mom, I'm really busy right now. I can't talk. You listen to me. I am your mother. You listen to me. Bestie, I'm on my third lyric now. I could really become a finalist and win millions. That's great. I just got my third lyric now. What does it say? Huh? Die in the dark or die in the light? I have to choose dark. Light is everywhere. There's no way I can avoid it. Hey, Bree. Bree! Sorry, I was just sleeping. I've learned to sleep with my eyes open because if I close my eyes too long, I'll die. What are you talking about? Oh, wow, that skirt is so cute. Thanks. It's from Halara. It's super stretchy. It has built-in shorts. And the best part is, because of the design, it doesn't ride up. It's too bright in here. Let's turn the lights off. No, don't do it. If it gets dark in here, I'll die. Hey, Brie, are you okay? Yeah, my vision's just a little blurry. I think I need my eyes checked. Thanks for coming in today, Brianna. I have some unfortunate news to tell you. You're rapidly going blind. Wait, if I go blind, that means everything will be dark. <laughs> Mommy, I promise one day I'm going to be a princess for real. No, you should never make a promise. Now you only have 10 years to fulfill your promise or else. Or else what? I go on timeout? A permanent timeout. When I was 10 years old, I made a promise that I would have kids one day. Now I have to have kids by 20. Whoa, that's so young. 
I know. I didn't know about the 10-year rule. When I was six, I made a promise that I would be a princess. Brianna, that's never going to happen. There's no way a prince would marry an average citizen. I know. I'm probably going to be dead in the next year. Attention, everyone. What is going on? The prince is throwing a royal ball to find his princess. Even all you common folk are given a chance to impress the prince. I might kill my ex. Not the best idea. Ow! What did you do that for? No, no. Stop. In the name. I just killed my ex. I just killed my ex. Not the best idea. It's me. Hi. I'm the problem. It's me. Killed his girlfriend next. How'd I get here? You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. Mama just killed the man. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Run, run, run away. Anna, I don't want to be the one to tell you this, but that is not your mom. I am your real mother. She doesn't know what she's talking about. She doesn't even know me. You're right. You think you know my own mother better than I do? You're just never happy for me. Brianna, wait. Ella's mom, what are you doing here? Ella never came home from school yesterday. Since you're her best friend, I thought you might know where she went. I don't. I'm sorry. Jake, we have to cancel our date tonight. My best friend's missing. I'm really worried about her. That's no problem. Get some rest. You've been talking to Jake a lot recently. Yeah. I really like him. Honey, hurry downstairs. I have a surprise for you. Surprise! Ella, Jake, I don't think they're breathing. Since you like them so much, I brought them to you. Hello, Brianna. Hi. The name is... I'm your new neighbor. Where are you off to? School. Are you going alone? No, I'm not alone. I'm meeting my friend. She's just over there. Mom, the new neighbor is kind of weird. He gives me bad vibes. Do you know his name? We can look him up on public data check. By type. Getting 2 million followers can't be that hard. I'll just, like, twerk or something. Sis, how do you already have 20,000 followers? Um, because I'm hot, unlike you. At least my personality is in, like, a cardboard box. This is definitely gonna go viral. Post. Oh, I wonder how many followers I got. Two! That's not fair. I've spent an hour getting ready. The makeup you put on can't fix all the ugly on your face. <gasps> I think you broke my nose! You know what? You deserved it. Bitch. I'm never gonna get famous. Yo, you're the girl from that video, right? What? That punch you threw was fucking crazy. How do you know about that? It's all over World Star, duh. No way. Yeah, they posted it oh, on Barstool, whoa. too. Oh! I really don't care what the amount is. Daddy will just pay for me. Ugh, that's nothing. Daddy. What's up, sweetheart? I need three million dollars. That's a lot. Why? So that I can meet my soulmate, duh. All right, anything for you. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, I want to pay him the money so I can meet my soulmate. Okay, um, how much? Three million. So do you want to start a payment plan? No, I'm paying in cash right now, all of it. Oh, um, okay, wow. <laughs> all right, is this some kind of joke? No, why would it be a joke? Because all of these bills are counterfeit. What are you talking about? My dad just got that for me. Yeah, right. You're trying to pay us with fraudulent money. No, there's been a mistake. My dad is rich. Well, then apparently he's been scamming everyone. We're going to have to take you into custody for this. I got angel? This must be a mistake. You're not an angel. Why are you never kind to your own daughter? Yeah. Mom, you're always so mean to me. And for what reason? It's tough love. It's not mean. No, you just like my sister more. Wh uh, what? That is not true. Yes, it is. And I'm sick of it. Yeah, you tell her, honey. I wish I never had you. You're a disappointment. Don't listen to your mother. She doesn't mean it. No, I know, Grandma. Good. 
Out of all people, you got angel? What do you mean? You're not angelic, like, at all. I don't know, it's just what I was given. Well, it's wrong. I deserve it. Not you too. It's not fair that your name is better when I'm the best child. Ugh, and my name isn't even Lily. It's Devil. It's what? Then why does your name appear as Lily? Mom got them to switch it for me so that everybody wouldn't hate me. I knew something was up. You need to get out of my house right now. What? Where am I supposed to go? I don't care. Figure it out. But not here. You can stay with me, Angel! Thank you, Grandma. Don't you dare come back here until your name is changed. I'm not changing my name. Okay, I guess I'll never see you again then. Guess so. This is the guest room. You can sleep here. Seriously, thank you again. Of course. I love you. My housekeeper's doing a run today, so we might come in. Okay. Uh, hello? Oh, hi, sorry. Oh, this room's usually empty. Are you a guest? Yeah. I'm Angel. Uh, my name is Loser. I know it's bad. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. And I know I lose control of the things that I say. Yeah, I was looking for a way. Yeah, now I can't escape. Nothing happens after two. It's true. It's true. My bad habits get to you. Hey, um, isn't that guy over there your ex-boyfriend? Yes. Why is he at our school? He doesn't even go here. Maybe he's just dropping someone off. Everyone, please welcome our new student, Ryan. No. Is it a bad thing? You still talk to your exes. That's the problem. He's my only ex that I don't still talk to. Oh, what happened between you guys then? I don't want to bring it up. Oh, Bailey. It's uh funny to see you here, huh? You know that I go here. Why are you at our school? I had to transfer schools because of my parents' divorce. Whatever, just don't bother me. Wait, I just wanted a second chance with you. You broke my heart. Girl, you better stop blinking like that or you're gonna run out. No way, I have one million blinks in my jar. I'm totally fine. Okay, well that doesn't mean that you should just waste all of them. I'm not wasting them. You're just jealous that you don't have any. That's not true. I have 69 <laughs> blinks. Can you please give me some from your jar? I only have two left. Oh, I'm sorry. I actually only have like... 20 left. I can't. Didn't you just tell Amy that you had one million blanks? Uh, no, I didn't. <laughs> hey, Jessica. Bailey, stop it. <laughs> Made you blink. That's not funny. Not all of us have, like, <clears throat> infinite blinks. Whatever. I thought it was funny. Why can I not blink anymore? <gasps> but I had a million this morning. How does that even happen? Huh, I guess you shouldn't have wasted them like I told you. Don't you dare make fun of me right now. I'm struggling for my life. Attention, however many blinks you have left in the jar will be permanent in an hour. No! Hey, can you come pick me up? Yeah, sure. Where are you at? Your house? Uh, on the side of the road. What? Ew, why are you on the street? I'll tell you when you get here, okay? Fine, I'm on the way. Bailey? Uh. Finally, you're here. What took you so long? You live five minutes away. Um, I... Um, you have to unlock the door. I can't let you in the car. I'm sorry. Why? You're raiding. But that's what I was going to explain to you. It's not what you think. Go ask someone else for a ride. What am I supposed to do now? I can give you a ride instead. How do I know you're not going to kidnap me? I won't. I promise. You have my word. All right. I have nothing to lose. So, where do you need a ride to? Honestly, you can drop me off anywhere, just not here. What do you mean? I got kicked out of my house. You can just come stay with me. I finally got my zodiac sign! Really? What'd you get? It says Gemini. I'm so excited. Oh, you're a Gemini? Ooh. What's wrong with being a Gemini? Nothing, nothing. Fine, well then, what are you? I haven't gotten mine yet. As long as you're not a fire sign, I don't care. Okay, whatever. Bailey, we all got water signs. That's great. Don't you agree that water signs are the best? I don't know. What do you mean? What's your sign? Uh, Pisces. Then you should agree. Yeah. I can't wait to be put with all the other water signs. What? They're gonna check our signs. Are you okay? No, I'm fine. Psst. Hey, psst. 
Me? Yes, I need to talk to you. What? You weren't given a zodiac sign either, were you? How did you know that? It doesn't matter, but you need to come with me right now. Hey, fine. Excuse me? Oh, yes? You dropped this. Wow, thank you so much. Honey, get away from her right now. She's a killer. I'm not, I, I swear. I see that mark on your face and you can't lie. You should be ashamed of yourself. Hey, are, are you doing all right? No, Mom. It happened again. Everybody thinks I'm a killer. Honey, you know it wasn't your fault. Don't listen to them. They don't know what happened. I know. Shoot, do you have a pencil I could borrow? Are you going to murder me if I don't give you a pencil? No. Oh, well, I don't have any extra anyway. Sorry. Whatever. Dylan, nice to meet you. You can go have a seat next to Bailey. Hey, new kid, don't talk to her. She's a killer. Sit with me instead. Um, nah, I'm good. I'm gonna sit over here still. Hey, what's up? I'm Dylan. Hi. Listen, I have a mark too, but I covered mine up. Hey, table five needs a refill on their wine. Okay, I'll do it in one sec. Here's another drink for you guys. Is there anything else I can get you? No, but you seem like a beautiful soul. Have a Merry Christmas. Thanks. Someone left a gift for you on the to-go counter. A gift? Maybe it's from one of my regulars. You're so lucky. I wish I'd get a gift. You are the most beautiful girl I've ever seen. Enjoy the makeup. Secret Santa? I don't know anyone who would have given me an anonymous gift. The mystery is part of the fun. Enjoy it. <laughs> oh, uh, hey, Bailey. I am not taking table four. They smell like broccoli and B.O. No, there's another gift for you. Oh. Here's something to remind you of me, Secret Santa. You have to find out who's been leaving me these. Excuse me, ladies. Please don't be someone I already know. I can't deal with that. No. Please, not him. Anyone but him. So, did you find out your soulmate results yet? Don't ask me about it. Oh. You'll never guess who my soulmate is? Mark? Yeah. Yeah, I knew it. You two have been in love since, like, sixth grade. Yeah, you're not wrong. But what about you? Who's your soulmate? Knowing you, it's gonna be, like, Chandler or something. How did you know? I was just kidding. <sighs> you seriously cannot avoid him forever. Yes, I can, and I plan on it. Let him explain himself. Bailey, wait. Nope. Yo. What? Did you get your results today? Yeah, I did. Well, happy birthday, but, uh, I'm assuming you know we're soulmates. I don't want to be your soulmate, or really even your friend, so don't talk to me. What? But the system. I don't care. Part two, let's blend it in before I have dots in my face for the rest of my life. I'm going to spray because I think the contour dried. Oh, I got it in my mouth. <laughs> okay, let's start on the lighter parts of my face so they don't blend together. And this side... I have high hopes for this. I think it's going to turn out good, and I might just be telling myself that, but... I think I'm gonna go for contour now, mostly because I don't want a beard when this dry... Please blend out. Oh, it is. Okay. <laughs> Does anyone else, like, beat the fuck out of their face? This is where it gets a little bit nerve-wracking. And now blush. Concealer, and then the nose. This turned out way better than I thought it would. I look so good. <laughs> Oh, good morning. What is on your neck? What do you mean? What is that? Uh, it looks like a broken heart. No shit, but why is it there? Don't ask me. Uh. Hey guys, did you get a tattoo on your neck? Nope, I have no idea where this came from. Huh, that's weird. Girl, I still can't believe you're dating Kyle. I've literally seen him cheat on you before. You should break up with him. You're right, I'm gonna break up with him right now. Wait, really? Kyle, we're done. Don't talk to me ever again. Huh. What is going on? Hey! Me? Yes, you. You can control minds too, huh? Um, no. Are you sure? That's what the mark on your neck means. What? Hey, Mom, what's this? Oh, that number shows you how much people love you. Why do you only love me 90%? You threw up on me one too many times as a baby. Seriously? Hey, girl. Oh my gosh, I have tea. I can see how much people love me and... And what? And I just remembered I have to pee. Bye. Doesn't even like me, and we've been friends for four years. So, who's the friend that doesn't like you anymore? None of your business, Jack. 
Hey, all I'm trying to do is comfort you. Listen, I'm in a bad mood and I don't need this energy right now. Okay, well, by the way, Mel was the one who leaked that video of you. What? A video that ruined my life. She leaked it. Yup, and she confessed to it on her private Twitter. <sighs> okay, come with me. Where are we going? We're taking that bitch down. Honey, why do you look like a chipmunk? You can breathe, you know? Why are you doing that? <sighs> I was trying to hold my oxygen in. For what reason? You know our family has infinite oxygen cans. Well, about that... I kind of lost my special canister. You did what? I'm sorry. How many sips do you have? Twelve. You better hope that you get that can back. Uh. Bailey, can you please give me a sip of oxygen? I'm sorry, Amanda. I can't today. What? But you always do. Don't be greedy. I know you have infinite. I lost my can and now I have a regular one, so I can't. I'm sorry. Uh-oh. How the hell did you lose your special can? I don't know. I put it down on my desk and when I turned around, it was gone. Do you think that somebody would have stolen it from you? You think somebody would have the balls to steal my oxygen can? Oh, do you mean this oxygen can? Zach. So let me get this straight. Zach is your little brother? Yeah, um, unfortunately, he is. Does that mean that you can get my can back? I can try to help you, but he is rarely ever at the house. Well, where does he go? To his girlfriends. He practically lives with her. I can't believe anyone would date him. And how do you look like that and he looks like a rat? Well, he's a half-brother. We have different dads. That makes sense. I'll help you get it back under one condition. Okay, what condition? You have to go on a date with me. <laughs> that seems like a win-win. I'm in. Meet me at this address after school. We'll get it. Okay. Okay, my brother's room is right here. Are you ready to go in? I'm ready. Three, two, one. Zach, give her her oxygen can back. Yeah, give it back. You guys are too late. I don't have it anymore. What do you mean? Where did my can go? I sold it for so much money. I am not doing that. You could not pay me enough. You don't want to do what? Don't worry about it. I'm not picking. The fuck? Okay. Okay, I can do it. I can do this. It's fine. I don't need my left arm. I'm right-handed anyway. It'll be fine. I can't. I can't do this. I know what I have to do. Hey, Melanie, I got you a drink. Oh, thank you. Of course, it's no problem. Guys, Melanie's on the floor in the bathroom. <gasps> oh, no, is she okay? I don't think so. She looked pale. How could this have ever happened? Guys, she's not breathing. <gasps> she's dead? No. Um, bitch, are you being sarcastic? No, I'm not. How did this happen? Yeah, poor Melanie. And can I begin to live what? Again? Oh my god. Um, what just happened? You don't want to know. Was that part of the game too? Yeah, it was. That's pretty bad. Mine have not been like that. This is getting out of hand. Is that a school computer? No. What are you doing with it? I'm stealing it. Girl, I'm gonna snitch. Shut up, don't snitch on me. I have to. Fine, I won't, but you better give it back. Oh, it's fine. That's not even that bad of a lick. Don't panic, but Joe is walking in our direction. Why is he walking over here? I don't know. How do I look? You look like shit. Shut up. Hi, Joe. Bailey, would you want to go on a date? Oh my god, I... Would hate that. Wait, what? I thought you liked me. Nope, I've never liked you before, ever. You're actually really ugly. Damn, you're a bitch. Yeah. Fine, I'll just go then. What? What are you talking about? It's just something about you. I feel like I'm in love. I mean, how? We've only spoken, like, a couple times. I never stopped thinking about you after the day we met. I don't know. I mean... Let me make it up to you. Just give me one more chance. Okay, but this is your last one. Okay, I totally understand that. Hi, everyone. We have one more new employee this year, Tate. Are you okay? Um, is something wrong? Um, no, nothing's wrong. So, can I pick you up at 8 tonight for the date? Yeah. Yeah. That's a wrap for this week. Everybody enjoy your weekend. Hey, wait. Uh, my name's Tate. I think I know you.
My dad owns a large lollipop company. We're trying to find someone to make the best new flavor. Is something wrong? No. Ooh, I'm gonna make a chili cheese fries lollipop. That sounds gross. I thought it was a good idea. Sorry. Uh, hey, Bailey. Bro, fuck off. Tate, don't. Well, I was just trying to help you. Well, it's not helpful, okay? Do you have any ideas for the contest? Nope, I don't. Really? You don't have a single idea at all? No, I mean it, and I don't want to talk to you, so please, just stop. I mean, are you sure you really should- Ow! You just punched him in the face. He was bothering you. A million dollars? Crazy, right? Your flavor was chosen over a hundred thousand others. All of the funds will be transferred into your account on Monday. Okay. Who did this? So, uh, what are you gonna do with all that prize money you just won? It was you? Surprise! I wanted to make it up to you, so I let you win. I mean, wouldn't there be people who are more deserving than me? I don't think so. You deserve everything and more, Bailey. I know that this is crazy, but please, I just wanted one more chance with you. I don't know, Lucas. I'll do anything. I mean, we're even firing Tate from the company. Firing him? He was never a good employee. I truly just want the best for you. You're beautiful. Excuse me, miss, you dropped these sunglasses! Oh, thank you. Wait, these aren't my glasses. Just keep them, I'm too old for that style! I like these. Guess it's my lucky day. Hey, little miss. Um, hi. What you doing out here all alone? I'm just waiting for the bus. I can give you a ride. No, I don't need a ride. It's fine, I can wait. Are you sure? It's a little cold. I'm sure. You have a great day then, beautiful. <sighs> Did she give me magical glasses? What is this? Um? What's up, honey? Can I try something on you? Yeah, of course. What is it? Tell me a fact. Any fact. It's a fact that I love you. <gasps> I'm adopted! What? How did you find that out? And you never told me? Hey, babe. Sorry, I let myself in. Not right now. Wait. Why do you have sunglasses inside? How would we help each other? I want you to be in a fake relationship with me so people will get off my back about being single. No way, this isn't to all the boys I've left before. Listen, I'm the quarterback, and if you date me, your rank will immediately become higher. Deal. Hey guys, this is my girlfriend. You're dating him? Yeah, I am. You know, I forgive you for getting me detention yesterday. Great, then we can be friends. Yeah, definitely. See, I told you this was going to work. Are you guys running for prom queen and king? Uh, I don't know about that. Yeah, of course we are. I did not agree to this. Okay, then you can continue to be a loser. How did my rank move up that quickly? Um, it's because you're dating me. Everyone loves me. Your head is so big, I'm surprised it doesn't fall off. Hey, sis, wait up. Get away from me or I'll punch you in the gut. Did I do something wrong? Yes, dude, you took my spot. What do you mean I took your spot? I used to be under 100 and now I'm not because of you. I need this on my face forever. I'm going to try to recreate this, but with makeup. For this, I'm actually going to use an eyeliner pen in the shade Nude Haze from NYX. I like this pen because I can make bigger spots with it, and it'll look more realistic in the end. I'm going to put these kind of everywhere where the filter had them. Ooh, that was a lot. Okay, this doesn't look that bad. I'm going to use this little Benefit Precisely My Brow Pencil to get some smaller freckles in it. I'm going to tap them in with my finger a little bit, because this is really aggressive in person. Okay, the moment of truth. This is with the filter on. Wait. Why did I kind of do a really good job? These look better than how I normally do my freckles. Number 1,000? What is that even supposed to mean? Did I just hear you say you're up in the thousands? Yeah, it looks like it. Ugh, I'm embarrassed for you. That's bad. Why? The higher your number, the less people that like you. Huh? That's not true. I am not that mean. Well, you definitely must have done something for that rating. Ugh. Am I that much of a bitch? Hey guys, you don't think I'm mean, right? No, I would just say brutal and aggressive. Oh. You never care what we think. I'll tell you later, I need to fix this. It's so cold. Hey. Please don't hit me! I wasn't going to. Wear my coat. Oh, um, okay, thank you. Sorry for screaming. I need perfume, I think I smell. You don't, but here, use mine. Does anyone have a pencil? I do, here. Ugh, I'm so thirsty. Please, drink some of this. This is working so well. 
Bailey to the principal's office now. Oh, come on. Hi, we're gonna do a get ready with me because I'm crying, but it's a good cry. I promise. So backstory, when I was younger, I wanted to be a pop star. I played so many instruments. It was the ukulele, the flute, the viola, trombone, and now the electric guitar. I was also obsessed with Broadway musicals and I accidentally taught myself how to sing. I have always been way too nervous to sing around anybody, so nobody knew. After probably five years, I finally worked up the courage to sing in front of people. <laughs> Side note, go buy this cream bronzer right now. It's by Tarte. Today, I'm going to a recording studio for the first time ever. We're going to record covers of some of my favorite artists. And before y'all start yelling at me that every TikToker tries to be a musician, this is like a lifelong dream fulfillment for me. I'll give you guys a hint as to what I'm covering. <clears throat> Sour. If you want to see it when they're done, they're going to be on YouTube and potentially Spotify. So stick around. You know you need to take that hat off for the check. <laughs> what? Why would I have to do that? So they can see your hair? Duh. I'm bald. You just said that you had lice. Um, yeah, they ate all of my hair off and now I'm bald. Okay, right. What are you hiding? I'm not hiding anything. Whatever. They're gonna find out what it is anyway. <laughs> Next. Um, can you take off the hood? No, actually all of my hair fell out. I can see some of it. Take it off. Okay. Really? I meant the hat, too. I can't. What's your reason this time? I glued it to my head. I don't believe that for a second. Oh my god, your hair, it's purple. What? My hair is not purple. Yes, it is. I can literally see that. No, it's obviously brown. Are you trying to gaslight us into thinking your hair is not purple? Did it work? No, come with us. We are about to get our first challenge of the day. I bet I can find my soulmate before you. How does a hundred dollars sound? Okay, bet. Oh, my first challenge is so easy. I can't wait to beat you. Bye. Uh, that is literally middle school behavior. I have to name it? Who cares? Westwood Secrets 411. I am never going to use this. I'm sorry. This is literally the plot of Gossip Girl. John is actually 5'9 and not 6 foot. He's been lying to all of us. Bro, you're short as hell. I knew you weren't 6 foot. What's with all the commotion? Did you not see? Someone made a school gossip account. <laughs> That's so funny. Right now? I have to go pee. You literally just went to the bathroom. Uh, well, it's coming again. Bye. I'll just keep posting stupid things nobody cares about. Send. You got me going. Guys, I have the most insane story time of my entire life for you. Before the story time, I just wanted to tell you I am selling this hat and a poster at the District Lines main stage at Playlist Live. I'm also going to have a meetup tomorrow where I will be signing them, so if you purchase merch, I will sign it tomorrow. At this point, we all know that I sing. Whether you like it or not, I still do it. Yesterday, I was minding my business with my manager and friends when we get an email asking if I wanted to perform in the kickoff show. The Playlist Live kickoff show. At first, I'm like, no, I'm going to pee my pants. I'm going to fall off the stage. I don't know. Something's going to go wrong. And then I'm like, wait, I kind of want to do it. I have never performed anything live in my life. Yes, I do covers, but they're pre-recorded in the studio, and it's only in front of two people. I literally had two hours notice, no rehearsal, got up on this stage and performed live in front of, like, a lot of people. I'm still trying to process this a little bit. Like, words cannot describe the experience I had yesterday. I felt like a pop star. My dreams literally came true. Just wow. Guys, I got scammed. <laughs> I was trying to find a cute Instagram boutique and I've had really good luck with some of them. I just wanted some tops, dresses, you know. So I ordered off here. Wear Remy. Sustainable reused packaging. It wasn't a plastic mailer from China. So I picked this dress, right? Cute, fun. I literally look like an off-brand Polly Pocket, like one you'd find on the ground at the dollar store. Also, everything had that Shein smell. If you know what I'm talking about, which is not a good sign. I got another dress, and the best part about this one is when I zipped it up, it wouldn't unzip, so I had to cut it off of me. I just... This one wouldn't zip at all. I also ordered one more shirt that they just completely left out of my order. Don't tell people your clothing is sustainable if you drop shipped it from China. Um, do you think you could tell me the new location that he works at? No, I can't disclose that information. Sorry. Could you move if you don't mind? There's people in line behind you. Wait, but what about the free dum-dum with each order? 
I'm sorry, we don't do that here. I'm never going to be able to find him again. There's like 300 locations just in my area. Are you excited to start your new job today? Yes, I can't wait to meet everyone. You'll be amazing, don't worry. <laughs> Thanks. Hi, everyone. Welcome to your first day on the job. I'll give you guys a few minutes to get to know your coworkers. Um, excuse me, have we met before? I'm not sure. I don't think so. I'm sorry, it's just that you look really familiar for some reason. Maybe we met before or something. Hmm? What? I thought that he was bothering you. Yeah, that doesn't mean that you punch him. So I assume this means you don't want to go on a date anymore? No, definitely not. Could both of you please just leave me alone? Wait, just one thing. What, Lucas? Here. I know it's your favorite. Thanks. Excuse me. Yes? Are you Bailey by any chance? Yeah, that's me. Congratulations, you won the contest for the best new flavor. Wait, what? Your entry was chosen to be the winner. But I didn't even enter a flavor. Um, I don't know, there's just one listed under your name. The prize fund is a million dollars. Congrats! Huh? Oh, hey Bailey, good morning. Hey. I'm not ready for this test. Where did these come from? Uh, I don't know, I didn't put them there. They were just sitting on my desk. Maybe you have a secret admirer. Right, that's funny. <laughs> you, uh, you tired? <sighs> yeah, I didn't get much sleep last night. Another? If you're doing this, just tell me now. I'm serious, it's not me. Is there a note? No, they didn't leave anything with it, it's just earrings. I mean, that's kind of weird. Mm -hmm. And there it is. Hair clips this time. If they want to give you free things, let them. I'm not complaining. We have to be here early for a meeting tomorrow, remember? Yeah, I know. I'll be there. Everyone, please have a seat. Did Emily just put something on my desk? What do you mean we're the only two? I cannot be left in charge of anything. Usually there's more than that. Ever committed a crime? No. Uh, I haven't either. How were you two even selected, then? I don't know. Don't ask me. Whatever. You're gonna need to be more intimidating. Why are you making that face? Oh, I thought that was a mean face. Literally never do that again. Just go change into something else. Okay, no need to shout. Okay, that's slightly better. Act more mean, you're too approachable. I can't, I'm not mean. Everyone's a little bit mean. My friends call me a golden retriever. Can't we be nice criminals? Fine, but there's one thing I need to tell you guys. What? Every year, you have to kill two people as a criminal. Yo! C am I hearing that right? If you don't kill two people, they'll take your life instead. No, I can't do this. 